It's devastating to have to come on here and share that whenever I was 19 years old, Gucci third leg burned me with HSV2. And he told me that he was going to send me his test results. And he never did. And it saddens me to hear that he's done this to so many girls. And there's girls with so many similar stories to me. And they're so young as well. He is preying on the young. He is preying on the new. And I'm so sorry for not saying this seven months ago. Freaky ass scared. nigga. He is 69. And God. So much money. I just. <laughs> I can't keep beating around the bush. Because you guys think I'm lying. And he can't ruin anybody else's life. I didn't know. I didn't know what he was known for. I didn't know who he was. I didn't do my research. And it is my fault. Now, apparently, she's saying she didn't do her research. But, you know, she had a lot of time to do some research. Because she didn't just have sexual relations with this Gucci third leg guy one time. Huh? She added a few. <laughs> she added a fucking few. And so once that got exposed, that hit the internet. The internet, I mean, it only fast Twitter went a blaze. <laughs> it went a fucking blaze, right? You had a lot of people coming out. This started like to go viral. Three, this, three I guess, this, this is him, and this is in a hundred. But I was really I, wait, I, I wait, didn't feel too bad three, about three thousand. My body what? was like. Three three thousand and a hundred, but I was really his body count is three thousand and a hundred. I, I I didn't feel too bad about it because my ex chick down in the body had like two thousand or whatever. Whoa 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 whoa, buddy! Why are you throwing a woman under the bus to justify your nastiness? <laughs> this is a, this is sexual deviant right here. This nigga needs to seek help. But so it was like when when I was dealing with my chick, she couldn't really be like, oh, your body counts too much because her body count like 2000. My body count like 3000. So it's like, damn, like I ain't feel too too bad about it. Honestly, last year. My OK, so. I mean, well, what would you expect from a male corn star corn? I said corn. What would you expect from a male corn star? <laughs> like, I'm sure. Yeah, yeah, he has a lot of bodies. <laughs> that's some nasty work right there but either way so that that happened and not only is aiden getting caught in the mix of this but a, the, the shave frost guy is getting caught up in the mix of this and i'm, I'm trying to i've seen a lot of a lot of shit <laughs> i've seen a lot of shit let me go to fear buck fuck cause now nah, i love john cena I hate cussing that though. He's a dick. <laughs> Let's keep going now. Okay, so it was some shit like okay. I guess he had um the Danae chick on his stream at some point. I'm trying to see if he ever he he. I think he did post that clip, but come on, fear buck. She got to do better. But either way, he had her on her stream. He bit her butt. The, the oh, this nigga is laughing, bro. And this, is but him. he dead ass. Laughing, Eight. he's laughing at a guy, I guess, talking about them fucking the Danae girl that has to hurt. Um, he's laughing at him, and then he's about to brag that he smashed that same woman, a bitch ass who fucking fucked and sucked me. Danae, all fucking anytime, whenever I want. Oh, yeah, he definitely has to hurt. And then look, listen to, to pull it up and type shit. I wanted look, look, to look. pull it up anytime whenever I wanted to pull it up and type shit. Okay, I want y'all to remember that he says anytime <laughs> he wanted to get some pussy and head, she pulled up. <laughs> she pulled up. Like, he said it. So, honestly, let's be honest, y'all. We are safe to fucking assume. <laughs> we are safe to assume that he fucked her more than once. It can take any of his fucking low ass bitches and shit to pull up right now from. Okay, he's just bragging how he could take his bitches. But then this is this guy, I guess, finding out about the Shea Frost. And see, this is this is the Danae chick on the stream with the Shea Frost. I guess that's her pulling up anytime he wants her to. And they're saying this was June 14th, 2024. This was June 14th, 2024, y'all. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know.
But let's keep let's keep looking at the evidence. Look, we do the science over here. Shout out Danny. <laughs> but I'ma find out what's going on. <laughs> but anyways. So whoever that guy was, he was just talking about, he found out about the lifelong disease after messing with the girl who caught out Gucci third leg of hat. And he says he feels bad for Deshay, the guy that was just making fun of him, who slept with her after she collabed with Gucci third leg. Let's listen. She contracted herpes in March. I had sexual intercourse with her before my fight, which was February, I believe, I can't remember. I just missed the bit on my life, on everything I love. Gang donated one dollar. Melt it is okay. Ninety percent of the yes, world January. has herpes virus. January. So, so don't be mad if the test come back positive. I literally am saved by the bell on my life. I was saved by the bell, my nigga. I was saved by the fucking bell, bro. The bell? I was saved by the bell. Buzzer chat. beater, chat. Like literally months. God is so good, chat. Now. The nigga y'all need to pray Shout for God. is y'all man's Deshay. Y'all need to pray for uh fucking Lil Mike. Oh shit. I'm praying for them niggas. I'm praying for them niggas. I'm praying for them niggas. Shit, Bentley. Shit, she come down here and fuck every one of her past niggas. What? So she was not only was she giving it the Gucci third leg and getting a lifelong hurt, but she was passing it around to all of her ex niggas. That is some nasty work. That's some nasty work. I'm not even gonna hold y'all. But either way, so after presenting y'all with all this great evidence of clearly Deshay messing with her after she contracted the herpes because they said she got it in February. He was on stream with her June 14th, 2024. He said in this clip right here. Stream. Say it fucked again, Deshae. Fucked me. Then they all fucking, who, who fucking ate a bitch ass, who ate a bitch ass, who fucking fucked and sucked me. Then they all fucking anytime, whenever I wanted to, pulled up and type shit. Anytime, whenever I wanted to. This is what Deshay Frost had to say in response to everybody thinking he might have caught the herp. Herpes, okay? I do not have that. I do not have herpes. I actually talked to Danae when she came on my stream in June, right? We um talked at the stream and that's when I knew. I knew before the whole world knew in June after the stream. When the time I personally, not to put people's business out, but the time I had sex with her was in December when I shot my season three. My season three. When she came on stream, we talked and she was she pulled me to the side and she respectfully she was like, Yo, I have you know what I'm saying? So and so gave me this and I just want to let you know before you know what I'm saying, like anything further, because I know we had, you know, back then. So I was like, for sure, like, you know what I'm saying? And I don't know why people speaking on my name. First of all, bro. Wait, 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 hold up, hold up. First things first. I'm going to tell y'all about woman right now. First things first. How tall do y'all think this nigga is? Because you look about Kasanat height. Like, I just feel like I don't even talk about people, bro, real shit. And just for niggas just to keep bringing my name up just to get clipped. Cause I ain't never seen nobody anything until Welcome to I Am Savvy Mike TV. So like <laughs> niggas start talking about me, bro. I don't get that shit. Whatever. Like people like saying things, like bringing me into like anything, bro. When was the last time, you know, we This is him on the phone with the Danae woman right now. We had sexual relations. We had sex. The only time we really had sex was whenever I was on your show. In December, in, the in December, right? Come on, guy. Come on, guy. She's literally saying the any time we fucked was whenever I was on your show. And she's been on your show a plethora of times. And you mean to tell me he was buying her ass in June without knowing she had the HPV or the HSV, whatever it's called? Stop the cap. That's why I got this hat on today. <laughs> These niggas, I was listening to it all weekend. I was hearing it all weekend. Nothing but cap. It's like, what the fuck is going on? 
November, actually. November, yeah, yeah. We shot the end of November and we posted it in December. Now, I don't know if he has HPV or not. Not going to say that. Not going to say that. But I do know he's not telling us the truth. Because he's making it seem like this was a one and done type thing. And I venture to believe that he was having sex with her after February. I do believe that. Um, yeah. when did you, when did you like contract, you know what I'm saying? Like, I contracted herpes February 10th or the 13th, one of those two days. Ain't that a bitch. February 10th. Man. But regardless of him, Aiden Ross is actually not even like, he's not even playing. He's like, oh shit. Wait, what the fuck is going on? What's happening right now? Be honest, chat. If would you guys fuck a girl like with herpes, like and you knew it or not? No, I didn't know. Just met up with Gucci third leg. This is Sky Bree. <laughs> Tape dropping soon. Holy shit! Is this real? Is it real, Aiden? You're looking at it. Bear back. Oh, he got mad. He got mad and went right off. It's not even funny anymore. Oh, God. Hold on. This is hilarious, Aiden. I'm not even going to lie to you. I can literally listen to this shit while I go to the bathroom. I have to make a call really quick. Bear back. Oh, you like, I got I to gotta fucking blow her phone up because she didn't answer me. <laughs> I got to blow her phone up because she didn't answer me. Damn. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Now, this is, I guess this is Sky Bree on Aiden's. NBA Young Jew donated $1. Bro's trying to impress his 12-year-old viewers by bringing the most ran through LA Man, females. You know, so you don't care, through. little bro. See, you can't even. I got you. I got you, baby. Relax. Uh, Actually, I can't. I can't say that. Fuck. Um. I got you. No, you're good. You're good. You're not ran through. You're you're literally a wife type. I don't know why they say that. I can tell you're like genuinely being honest. Thank you. Yeah, you're wife type. Thank you. I'm not even joking either. You like actually have like a really good soul. I can tell. Thank you. Yeah. Again, you're joking. I'm really not joking. I've never let someone put their dick up my ass. <laughs> okay. Good soul, they say. <laughs> good soul, they say. She has a really a really good soul. Oh, man. Is there more clips? I thought I had more. I clearly don't. <laughs> I clearly don't. I'm sorry. I'm not doing my job well here. Wait, hold on. Let me go here. Let me go to Aiden Reports. Okay, wait, 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 wait. We got, we got some action. Aiden Ross is taking Lieutenant Dan's kick deal and has gifted the deal to Terrence, a friend of Dan, who plans to go around Tampa and in real life stream. He caught a look. He read them charges. It was like, never mind. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm going to hereby announce it. Fear about all you guys clip it. Tomorrow at 8 p.m. East, um, I'm having Big Gucci on stream. Big Gucci. <laughs> this nigga is interviewing the man with the herp. You're going to interview the nigga that fucked your bitch that gave you the herp? Aiden, you dead ass right now, bro? We might be here tomorrow, y'all. What the fuck? Because if you don't know, the OnlyFans models, they was on fucking Twitter spaces, you know, exposing the nigga. They deleted them. I, I can't go back and listen to them, but they were definitely on Twitter spaces exposing Gucci guy. Not going to say third leg. That's just a whole pause. He third leg on stream. He hasn't he's, he hasn't broke silence yet. He's going to be the first time to break it on my stream. Kick.com slash Aiden Ross. He's bringing a silence on my stream. He's going to talk about everything. And he wrote me a whole paragraph explaining like what he's going to talk about. Gucci third leg is going to come on my stream and explain the, all these lies and, and, and tell me and show, the, the, show up with the receipts and stuff. So to Whoa, lies and receipts? So are the women clout chasing? Does Gucci not have... HPV is he gonna is he gonna deny the claims like I hope he's denying the claims 
You better deny the claims, my nigga, because if you're spreading around STDs and these women aren't aware of it, you know that's a fucking felony, right? <laughs> like, what are we doing? Deny the claims, my nigga, please. Tomorrow, uh, he's going to be doing that. Wow. Oh. Breaking news, chat. Breaking fucking news. Gucci third leg will be on Aiden stream tomorrow. <laughs> Holy shit. I'm trying to see if I can find some more. Yeah, we already saw that one. Y'all see this? With the Jew. I did. I called him earlier today. Happy birthday, Aiden Ross. Yo, clip this. Birthday message to Aiden Ross. Mazel tov. Happy birthday, Aiden. W. Aiden Ross, W. Kick, we love you. You're one of the good Jews. Happy birthday, my nigga. W's in the chat. Birthday, my nigga. W. Jews. Happy birthday, my nigga. These are the niggas y'all give platforms, and they call me Academics 2.0, but you got a white fucker on here talking about some happy birthday, my nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking idiots, bro. Either way, then Lieutenant Dan just say nigga too? Wait, hold on. Let's, let's go look at Lieutenant Dan. I, I saw that as well. I don't know if that was on Fear Bucks or not. But yeah, little, little Lieutenant Dan just added insult to his whole fucking injury when it came to his career. Let's see. Let me go to Fear Rugs. Let's see. He might have it. Where's the Lieutenant Dan? <laughs> but you, if you want to get back into my good graces, just, you're going to have to take time. Hey, a lot of work, and it's going to be hard. Because once I cut you off, you're done, nigga. Aiden, you cannot be friends with races, bro. White people should not be saying the word nigga. I'm sorry.